from the No Money Spent episode six. You guys be getting damn near two, three episodes a day. I imagine I might drop a fourth video today just for you guys to give you guys extra content. But for sure, a lot of people probably be asking probably in the future videos, Bree, how are you making coins at this moment? I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys here. Let's get straight to No Money Spent episode six. Ladies and gentlemen, I know I forgot to turn my damn camera on. I do apologize for that. But essentially, how am I making coins at this moment? Now, keep in mind, it is currently Wednesday. The game's been released for two days. I've just been essentially grinding. I did a little bit of champs. I think head-to-head -head is currently glitch. Uh, I think the servers are down because I think they get ready for Gauntlet. I believe um, they were doing champs, but for sure, my ass really just didn't have time to actually finish them off. So I, I definitely didn't care. I was going to see Deadpool last night. But how is Bree making coins? As you guys see, I am at 600,000 coins. I did spend my points. If you guys didn't see what I spent my points on, go check the video out. I recommend you guys follow that method because that is very, very key on how I actually essentially made the coins here. So um, I'll just start with the basic one I actually did. If you guys have seen the shorts or TikTok, go check it out. What kind of helped jumpstart is doing the skills trainer because you do get 13 free um, rushing packs if you essentially do it doesn't matter i put it on rookie I, I do this every single time to give you guys advice and tips but uh if you guys for sure log in i you guys i got 12 out of 13 this one's still glitch but you if you do this you get 13 free packs now the reason why you want to do this rushing packs are actually really really good especially right now for one people aren't people don't have the game so not that many people are populating the market uh, I know it's kind of like a, 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 a price set issue going on at the moment, but people aren't spending money on the game at the moment. People are no money spent, and its goals are essentially good right now because some goals are better than some of the base elites because they're legit faster. So when you get all those goals, so what I essentially I've been doing, as you guys can see right here, Bree has been doing challenges. I'm going to do solo seasons and solo battles, what I've actually been doing, but the challenges have been very, very key, but mainly I think it kind of helped from, them, uh, from that uh, them packs as well. I have been selling a lot of golds. Now, keep in mind, I got lucky. Um, I did happen to buy the early bird special. I got some uh, some uh, coin uh, some coin cards as well. That helps, obviously. But for sure, m the market for what I've been doing has been selling golds for no money spent. If you're going to be no money spent, coin is always king. I have a lot of... If you guys can see, I have been selling a whole bunch of cards, y'all. Trust me. A whole lot of cards. Because it's, it's right now, it's the beginning of the year. No point in making unnecessary upgrades. We have the boom promo dropping tomorrow. So a lot of these cards, especially, is going to decrease in value. Um, I did the set for um the ultimate preseason. I picked, I forgot who I picked. The, well, they bought the same price anyway. I had pulled Marvin Harrison Jr., which he was like 18,000 coins. So the main recommendation I do recommend for you guys, if you guys are going to be no money spent and you guys want to make some coins, even if you guys are budget money spent, if you guys want to spend money on the game and you want to reduce your spending as much, grind out the solos, do them that method I told you if you want to do head to head and stuff like that, you can. I'm going to eventually do head to head probably tomorrow. But selling these goals right now is key. Trust me. I'm not going to spend 50,000 on the 80 speed. Uh, Running back, I refuse to do it. I'll just lose cheap. Trust me. I'm using somebody quick sale cards until I can get some better replacements for the moment. Uh, like I said, I have Evan Ingram. He goes prior for a lot as well. I'm pretty sure Evan Ingram. I pulled him from the coin uh from the platinum packs. Uh, he goes for I don't know, I don't know how much I can actually sell him for him, but I'm pretty sure just based off it's just, it's just 80 what 84 is the highest 81 is actually not that bad. It's actually really, really good. He's one of the fastest tight ends in the game. So, um, if I really wanted to sell him, he I could I could honestly sell him for thirty seven thousand coins and make more profit. It just at the moment I still want to be able to compete and at least play. But for sure, as you actually, I have a lot of gold just sitting in here grinding solos. You can use them if you want. If you want to feel comfortable doing it, you can. I don't blame you guys. But if you guys can just look and see, because everything's kind of set to a certain price, it can't go lower. Unless they fix it at the moment, I just kind of recommend just sell them off right now, especially um, if you guys have early access. While well, I'm posting this video, kind of maybe ASAP at the moment, because for sure, if you guys are going to be going forward with this, a thousand, if you have about 30 of them, that's 30,000 right then and there. 13 rushing packs, 14 technically. That's a lot, y'all. Trust me. They are like price hit. Whenever they fix this, these cards are probably going to end up being about 500. 600 uh 600 coins so why not just take advantage of it at the moment for sure at the beginning of the year build your team out wait for that first major market crash because it is bound to happen trust me the mark it may not happen the first legend week might happen the next legend week 
I wouldn't be surprised if one of the uh, promos is going to be glitched. So you never know. I, it is a, a limit for me that I can actually sell. Whenever these cars start to sell over time, so I'm kind of capped at the moment. So for sure, yeah, I'll probably be a mutt millionaire relatively soon as I normally spend. I, I'll spurge when need to. I'll be working on NCAA as well for you. I'm going to probably finish off champs, and then we go from there. So any questions, let me know in the comment section down below. I think as we made another sale. So like I said, these cars are going to be selling like that. Y'all trust me. I mean, it's, it's profit, y'all trust me. If you grind the game out, take a little bit of time. You might make maybe about 100, 200,000 just maybe if you can get lucky with an elite pool. But you never know. Hope you guys are the video man. I'm out, y'all. Peace.